code name Rover. Initial report, electronic copy below is per Federal Records Act. UIU file 1952-003, code name Rover. Summary, currently in the hands of domestic socialists. Object was discovered in Utah after civilian reports of a large explosion. Initial team killed by massive amounts of radiation, but brought by special agents. Object taken shortly after capture, location currently unknown. Suspect description slash capabilities. Name, N.A. Irregularity cross-reference. Animal, canine, radioactive, Soviet. Physical description. Creature appears to be a terrestrial mutt resembling a terrier with no notable identifying marks. Sex, female. Height, 18 inches. Weight slash build, 13.23 pounds. Small. Race, N.A. Hair, brown slash white. Eyes, brown. Identifying attributes. Intense radiation, collar. Capabilities. The creature is a small dog capable of generating extreme amounts of ionizing radiation without negative effects to itself. This ability appears to be linked to the emotional state of the creature with minimal emissions during states of contentment or playfulness and maximal emissions during states of fear or aggression. Purpose slash motive. Unknown slash survival. Modus operandi. Suspect is highly mobile and responds to stress with its anomalous effect. Behavior. Behaves as a normal canine would, but releases huge quantities of radiation when provoked. It does not appear to use this intentionally, as evidenced by the abduction. Evidence. A. One sample of hair, white, shed by creature during quarantine, does not emit any radiation. B. Metal wreckage. Remains of the spacecraft which it was found in. It is composed of unknown alloys, which have been resistant to sampling attempts. Stamped with Soviet hammer and sickle symbol. C. Photographs. Three photographs depicting agents investigating the initial crash site, losing their lives to the animal, and unknown third parties, possibly Soviet agents, interacting with the animal. Bureau record. Current status. Captured by agents, but lost. Current whereabouts unknown. Last sighted in Washington, D.C. on August 11th, 55. Non-lethal force authorized to recapture. Lethal force is authorized against current captors. Believed to be in enemy hands. Crimes. In A, as animals cannot be charged with crimes. However, the attributes of the beast have caused the deaths of several men associated with the agency, which the director has deemed to be an unacceptable loss of security. If applicable, the charges of manslaughter would be applied, in accordance with the Utah County in which the crime was committed. Sentencing. Indefinite detention. History of UIU action. Initial contact was made when an unknown object carrying the animal impacted the Zion National Park in Utah. UIU agents were on the scene within 12 hours and secured the scene at that time. Due to the remote nature of the location, civilian contact was minimal. Agents acquired assistance from the local contractors and Park Service Rangers to approach and investigate the object. Approximately 30 minutes after contact occurred, the animal began to exhibit deadly radioactive waves, causing the contractors to liquefy and pressurizing the suits to the point that their liquefied remains eject from the facial viewing pieces. It is not known if this was solely due to radiation. March 3rd, 52. After strong amounts of aerial reconnaissance, with assistance from the deceased contractors who had taken photographs at the scene, agents were able to locate and recover the animal. Once retrieved, agents were instructed not to provoke it, and it was taken in safely. Interred in a FBI facility manned by the UIU, who took over full responsibility for its incarceration. Director took personal interest in the utilization and possible weaponization of the beast. April 10th, 52. Disturbance reported, involving a possible break-in, after patrolling security noted damaged window, Bureau agents discovered that the animal was missing from its cell and that the observation chamber was highly radioactive. Isotope isolation work is currently underway. Agents have been assigned to recover this beast and improve security. Director has given all agents top secret clearance for their work. If contact is made with the animal, do not provoke or attempt to come into physical contact. Evacuate all American persons and proceed to incapacitate it using non-lethal methods. Do not attempt to intimidate the animal. You will die and compromise the lives of your fellow Americans.